How's it going everyone? It's me with Flash Nick here bringing you yet another life story video and yeah I know it's been quite a while since we've done one of these so uh, I hope you guys do enjoy it's a pretty nice one for you guys and uh, once again this story is brought to you by Twitter I asked you guys what you wanted to see first and actually it was a pretty even split it was like 50 50 on what you wanted to actually see first in fact it was so close that this one actually won by only one percent of the vote so uh, yeah if you want to participate in the next one uh, there is my Twitter at on screen right now, so all you have to do is go follow me on Twitter, and uh, you can participate in the next vote, as well as see all the random shit that I post there every so often. Also, just so you know, I have started picking up some live streaming here and there. I, I do it over my Xbox, my internet is shit, so it uh, kind of drops sometimes, but I like to interact with you guys on there, so if you want to follow me on Twitch, I'll have that on screen as well, and I will also have it in the the description down below so uh, yeah go ahead and follow me on that if you would like in fact I'm probably going to be live as soon as this video goes up so uh, yeah I should be up there and you can join a game with me it'll be fun and shit but before we do get started I would just like to say there is a massive shout out and thank you to the one the only Nader Gator 9 he submitted the gameplay which you are seeing on screen right now uh, if you would like to submit some gameplay of your own to be featured in another life story in the future, all you have to do is, you know, just leave a link to the submit gameplay in the comments or just send me a private message with it and you can probably be featured in another life story sometime in the future. But with that being said, let's just get right into the story because I'm sure that you are probably curious as to uh, what I'm talking about with the title of this. Uh, yeah, my, my sister fucking punching me. All right, so I, I have to start off the story by uh, saying I don't remember exactly when this happened. It, it was probably still in grade school, you know, probably around nine, 10 years old. I was pretty young, she was pretty young at this time as well. And well, uh, I had just gotten my bunk bed. Yes, I had a bunk bed at this age, and it was pretty cool. I liked it. It was pretty chill. Spent all day climbing on it, and my sister did as well every so often. And, you know, at, at the age that we were at, teasing was something that happened quite a bit. And uh, this, this all takes place one night. Again, I have no idea when this happened. It just kind of did one day and you know on this day me and my sister you know we were hanging out we were interacting you know we were having a good time and around some time where uh, all of this came to an end I decided you know what I I'm gonna fuck with her a little bit. You see around this time we, uh, we used to play a game in the house called Toss the Pillow and uh, it, this game was uh, we, we would just take a pillow we would turn off all the lights in the room wait until it was like nine o'clock at night you know where it was really dark there was really no lights outside that would light up the room basically it was pitch black you would stand outside the door toss the pillow into a room the person would go into it have the door locked behind them and they would have to find the pillow while someone else would be inside the room trying to scare the shit out of them yeah, it was kind of a fucked up game, though I highly recommend it to anyone out there who uh, wants to play it. It was pretty fucking cool, not gonna lie. It's generally at least a three-person game, you know, you just rotate, person throws the pillow, person searches for it, and last but not least, person hides and uh, scares the shit out of people. Now, uh, just keep in mind, that is what the game I was going for with, uh, fucking with my sister here, uh, and you'll see how, uh, my story differs a little bit from how the game is actually supposed to be played. So on this night in particular, I had, uh, gone into my room, my sister had followed me in, we were just, you know, hanging out, socializing, being, you know, brother and sister, and I don't remember exactly what led up to this moment, but the opportunity presented itself, and you know, I was just ready for it, and it, it worked out perfectly at first, you know. My sister had ended up climbing up to the top bunk of the bed, and you know, was just sitting up there, chilling out, and the opportunity presented itself, you know, I got up from the bottom bunk of the bed, ran out of the room, shut off all of the lights in the room, leaving my sister on the top bunk, 
with absolutely no way of seeing and you how get closed down. and locked the door. And I should probably preface that this time. My sister was really young, and uh, being locked in a dark room, that, that was basically a horror movie, you know, in the making right there. Uh, she probably thought that she was going to be fucking murdered by a monster or some shit. And, well, yes, it was a uh, kind of a dick move. I, uh, at the time, I was just dying of laughter because, you know, just hearing my sister, as soon as the lights go off, she turns to me with, like, the look of horror, like, oh, fuck, I know exactly what you're about to do. And then closing the door, it was probably the, uh, the highlight of my night, probably, uh, just the comedy aspect of it because, you know, she, she screamed like, Hey! Followed immediately by a thud on the floor, which I thought actually was her face planting off the bed. Fortunately, it was not, but uh, it was her actually literally jumping off the edge of the bed, sprinting to the door, and pulling it open. You know, my door doesn't lock from the outside, so uh, when she, <laughs> she opened the door, she kind of rammed into it, you know? Probably like a bull would ram through a door, just like head first slamming through it, sent me flying backwards a few feet. And while I was still dying laughing at this entire thing that went down, my sister, uh, she wasn't at all in the least bit amused, and uh, she, she got pretty mad at me. She called me a dick. Which, to be honest, yeah, I was kind of being a dick, but that's sibling how you play. It's gotta, gotta have fun. You know, gotta tease each other here and there. It's a good time. No, I, she, she didn't take it as any teasing at all. She, uh, she kind of took it pretty seriously, you know. Immediately, the fists were out. She uh, swung at my face. It connected uh, pretty fucking hardcore. And, uh, yeah, she hit me, like, right in the left eye. It, it fucking hurt like hell. I fell to the ground and, you know, was screaming like, What the fuck? You know, I was crying like a little bitch because, you know, fucking just got hit in the fucking eye. And, uh, yeah, at the end of the day, I pretty much got what I deserved for uh, doing that because, you know, as soon as uh, everything died down, I ended up getting a black eye from the entire incident. You know those uh, shiners you see in cartoons that they... They over-exaggerate how bad a black eye usually is. Yeah, that, that was generally what my eye looked like. And best thing was, it was on a school night, so, uh, yeah, I got to go around the next day at school looking like I was being abused at home, so that was great. Even better is that I had to tell basically everyone who asked about it was, uh, how did you, how did you get that black eye? What happened? Uh, well, uh, my sister's a fucking savage, so, uh, don't fuck with her. So, uh, yeah, word to the wise for anyone in the future, uh, planning to fuck with your sisters, or any siblings for that matter, by locking them in a dark room, they are not a fan of the dark. Uh, make sure that you have an eye patch nearby so you can at least look cool, and uh, not just walk around with a fucking black eye all day. Thank you very much. Anyways guys, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please hit that like button. And if you really liked it, hit that subscribe button. I would love a new addition to the Snake Army. Be sure to check out any of the uh, videos I have playing on screen right now. I have yesterday's video up there right now. It's uh, It was actually a video based on likes. You know, that thing that I just told you to do if you uh, enjoyed the video. By the way, please do that because uh, YouTube will absolutely fuck me in the butthole if you do not. You know, I did a bit of face cam in it. I, I still want to know your guys' opinion on that. So if you liked the face cam in yesterday's video, uh, make sure you leave a comment on it telling me that you like the face cam. Uh, if you don't like the face cam, tell me to uh, go on a fucking diet. And also, yes, I should be streaming right now as this video goes up, so uh, make sure you go ahead, click the link in the description to my Twitch channel. Go ahead and follow me on it, I'll be doing some streams every now and again. You know, sometimes fan interacting games, and sometimes, you know, just chilling out. Also, if you have any, any guy, go check out our bunnies right there, go ahead and click on them, it'll be great. But anyways, guys, again, thank you all so much for watching this video, I hope you did enjoy it. I will see you on the next one tomorrow as always with Lash Sunny.